Hey everybody, it's Dr. Sam, and I received a question from a listener about autism. How do I work with it? Well, it's a big question, and when you start working with the autism spectrum, better known as ASD, it's a spectrum of disorders where you have autism on one side of the spectrum, and you have ADHD, hyperactive disorder, on the other side of the spectrum. And there's so many different kinds of spectrum disorders, both in kids and adults. I had the good fortune in part of my training. I spent a year at the Gazelle Institute, which was affiliated with Yale University, and I studied child development, how to evaluate special needs kids, developmental delays, and coupling that with learning things in the areas of functional medicine, craniosacral therapy, and physical eye therapy, I've developed a program to help kids, no matter what level they're at, in terms of their sensory motor development, how their brain is functioning as it relates to their body. So when you're working with the spectrum disorder, the first thing you want to do is take a really good history. Some very important milestones would be the gestation period in utero, the birth experience, and the bonding experience. These three set the stage for a child's sensory motor development. Obviously, we have to look at things like traumas, nutrition, and there are many, many factors that go into both the diagnosis and the treatment of spectrum disorder people. Physical eye therapy comes in because part of the visual system as it connects to the brain has a profound influence on all of our sensory systems auditory, motor, proprioception. And the better we get at our sensory motor processing, the higher levels of cognitive processing we're able to do. So it's a, it's a big subject. I wrote a book a few years ago on treating autistic children. You can get that on my website, drsamburn.com. And I'll have more to say as we move forward. So thank you very much for the question.